Okay, Todd, the mic is working. Are you ready? Yeah, dude. I'll be right over there. <laughs> Sweet. Psychic readings! Get your psychic readings! Let the magnificent Danny tell your future! Only 50 bucks! Danny, what is all this? I'm giving psychic readings, bro! You're not psychic! Shut up! <laughs> yes, I am! Go away! You're scaring away my customers! Hey, Danny! Can you really see the future? Well, <laughs> give me 50 bucks and find out! Okay, fine! Okay, hold on! Uh, I'm getting something! I see that your car is gonna catch on fire today! What? Yeah, right. That is so fake. Oh my gosh, what was that? Sounded like an explosion. No, my car! My car! <laughs> no, no way. This is impossible. See, I told you I am psychic. Look at all this cash, dude. <laughs> I know. Great job today, man. Everyone totally bought it. Here's your cut. <laughs> Sweet. This was the best idea ever. <laughs> yeah, I know. I'm the one who came up with it. Todd, your mom's here to pick you. Whoa, what the heck? Pretty sweet, huh? Where did you get all that money? Giving psychic readings, duh. Yeah, man, you're like really dumb. Later, Danny. Dude, you seriously scammed that many people at school? You're not a psychic. Oh, okay then, prove it. Oh, that's right, you can't. I can prove it, and I will. You're not gonna get away with scamming people out of their money, dude. You're just so jealous of me now that I'm rich, and I'm gonna be famous. I know the difference between right and wrong, and this is wrong. Yeah, yeah, shut up and just get out of my room. Hey, stop it. Ugh, I'm going to prove that this is a scam. Danny can't get away with this. Danny, read my fortune! Daddy, well, I got an A in gym class. Danny, will Kelly be my girlfriend? Yeah, no. Okay, okay, everyone, calm down, calm down, one at a time. Oh my gosh, this has to be a joke. Yo, Danny, read my fortune now. <laughs> okay, Riff. Hmm, I see your locker. My locker? Is it three six seven? Yes, yes it is, 367. You keep something incredibly important in there. Yeah, I do. I keep my Switch in there. Oh, yes, it's your Switch. Someone is going to steal it. Something is not right here. Okay, Riff's locker is just over here. I got it. <laughs> Sweet. Seriously, man? Hey, what the heck? Get lost, Todd, or I'll go tell Principal Salt on you. Ugh, you're so lame, dude. Danny and Todd are such jerks. They're going to get in so much trouble if they keep this up. Dylan, you're stealing my switch? Daddy was right, and you're a thief, I hate you! Dude, let me explain. No, shut up! Ah! Principal Salt, Dylan stole my switch! Oh no. Sorry I'm late, Principal Salt, but I had to leave work early. I don't care, Mr. Anderson. You should be apologizing to me for raising a criminal. I didn't steal Riff's switch. It was Todd. Really? Then why did Riff catch you red-handed? Dylan, what has gotten into you? You know stealing is wrong. Dad, it's not me. Danny's running a scam pretending to be psychic. That's outrageous. Actually, Danny has been giving psychic readings, and they've all come true. Yeah, because Todd is making it happen while no one is watching. Enough! Mr. Anderson, Dylan is suspended for the rest of the week. Take him home at once. Of course. Come on, Dylan, let's go. This is so stupid. I'm grounded, and I have to do Danny's chores now? Dude, this car is sick. Oh, what's up, loser? Danny, what the heck is that? It's my new car, obviously. Danny, that car is super expensive. Did you buy it with your scam money? Um, I bought it with the money I made from my gift. Did your buddy tell you I caught him red-handed? Yeah, he did. And you better back off, loser, or else I'll get you in even more trouble. Yeah, leave us alone, or you'll regret it. I'm going to expose those jerks soon enough, and everyone is going to see the truth. Man, your brother's so lame. Yeah, I know, but he did catch you. You better not get caught like that again, because I have something else planned, and he needs to go perfectly. What do you have in mind? Your mom still makes rock candy, right? Uh, yeah, I think she does. Why? <laughs> oh, well, I have an idea. That's right, everyone. I, the Magnificent Denny, am selling special energy-enhancing crystals for anyone to buy. Step right up and get yours now. Only a hundred bucks a piece. 
What's so special about these? These look stupid. These are not stupid. These crystals were found in an ancient psychic cave. If you have one on you, it'll keep away negative energy and give you good vibes. Oh, sweet. I need vibes for the football game this weekend. I'll take two. Pleasure doing business with you, Riff. Wow, where did you get these, Danny? <laughs> Mind your own business, loser. Yeah, your vibe is just so bad, bro. Oh, I know. That's why I want one of your crystals. It's supposed to give me good vibes, right? Okay. What are you up to? I know you're up to something. Do you want the money or not? Todd, give him a crystal. Yeah, here. Now go away. Awesome. Thanks so much, guys. Fancy psychic crystals, huh? Yeah, let's see what this really is. Hey, Logan, can you run some tests on this thing for me? Danny's now selling these crystal things, and knowing him, it's probably another stupid scam. Uh, okay, this should be pretty easy enough. So what do you think? Is it real or what? Oh, yeah, it's real. Real rock candy, dude. It's nothing but sugar. Rock candy? I can't believe people are actually buying this junk. He's selling this for a hundred bucks. Oh, man, your brother's gonna get in some serious trouble for this. Yeah, man, and I'm going to expose him for it, too. Man, you're wasting your energy. Danny's gonna mess up like he usually does, and everyone's gonna find out the truth soon enough. You'll learn eventually, man. Trust me. Yeah, I hope so. I just hate seeing my brother like this. I know. But some people need to learn, even if it's the hard way. So, what do you think of this, Jade? Yeah, man, it's, uh, sick. Uh, speaking of, can I get my cut or what? Uh, yeah, 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 yeah. I'll give it to you when we get back to my place. Soon, man, we're gonna have way more money. Trust me, and we're gonna be famous! Hey, Eddie, I need to talk to you right now. Oh, uh, uh hey, Riff, uh, what's up? What's up? What's up is I should punch you in your face right now. That's what's up. The crystals I bought from you are fake. I had them in my pocket, and they just started melting. Well, uh, wow, Riff. Actually, that's really good luck. If the crystals melt, it means your energy is just so good. Great job, man. Oh, oh okay, sweet. Oh, never mind then. Sorry I wanted to punch you in the face. <sighs> that was close. Yeah, too close. Maybe we should just come clean, huh? What? No! You want more money, don't you? And I want to be rich and famous. We have to keep going until we get there. Uh, okay, fine, you're right. Yeah, I am. Now go buy me a churro at the food court. Thank you for helping me with dinner tonight, Dylan. Yeah, of course, Dad. Now where is your brother? Danny, get down here now! Ugh, what, Dad? Can you please set the table? Dinner should be ready soon. Oh, yeah, uh, no, I can't. I'm going out for dinner with Todd tonight. We always have dinner together on Sundays. You're not going out. Now set the table. No, I have to go out. I had a vision, and it's super important that I eat sushi tonight. Yeah, right. Again with this fake psychic stuff? It's not fake, you know. I had a vision you burned the mashed potatoes. And I had a vision that you're a liar and a spoiled brat. Boy, stop fighting. Danny, you're not psychic. Yes, I am. Hold on. I'm getting another vision. Can you believe this, Dad? It's so fake. Yeah, yeah. Hold on a second. Danny, what's wrong? Oh, my gosh. Todd is going to call me. Oh, what the heck? Hello. Oh, hey, Todd. Yeah, I'm leaving now. Bye, Dad. Dad, you're just gonna let him leave like that? Well, look, your brother has a gift, and we should respect it. Oh, great. Now he believes him, too? Hey, everyone! The Magnificent Danny has a super important announcement to announce! After getting permission from Old Man Saul, I will be holding a seance in the school at night, this weekend! That's right! Magnificent Danny will be talking to real ghosts here in the school! And it's only gonna be 500 bucks a person! And space is limited, so sign up now! You don't believe this stuff, do you? Nah, dude, I'm a man of science. It's stupid. Yeah, it is. I'm thinking I should go sign up for the seance. Hey, bro, can I sign up for your seance? No, space is limited, and your vibe will ruin the mood. Ah, fine. Well, he's not gonna let me sign up. Dude, just sneak in. How hard could it be? Yeah, good idea. You wanna come with me? <laughs> yeah, no chance, man. Okay, everyone, it's midnight. Let the seance begin. 
Okay, Danny. Let's see you crash and burn this time. I can hear the spirits of the dead. They're here with us. Oh, yeah? Prove it. Okay, spirits. This is the magnificent Danny. Please let your presence be known. <laughs> okay, how about this? <laughs> oh, my gosh. What is that? It's the spirits. Spirits, knock once for yes, two for no. Are you here with us now? Are you going to hurt us? Am I the coolest person at this school? Oh my gosh! <laughs> Pretty magnificent, huh? This is so stupid. I'm out of here. Oh my gosh, this is so crazy. In this video, it's gonna go viral. I know it! Hey, uh, where's dad? He's in his office. Why? Dad, get out here! What is it, son? Oh my gosh, what is that? I wanted to give you this. It's $10,000. Oh my gosh, how did you get all this money? By scamming innocent people? No, I held a seance and it went viral. I'm famous now, and guess what? I get to go on the Diane Show. The Diane Show? I love that show. Oh, this is incredible, son. I'm proud of you, Danny. Well, I'm not proud of you. I know you faked that seance. Todd was behind it, wasn't he? Uh, I don't care if you're proud of me. You're just being jealous again, as usual. No, I'm not. I just care for you. And I want you to be honest and come clean. And give up all this money and fame? <laughs> no way. Yes. You can't just lie to people for the rest of your life, dude. I can do whatever I want. I'm rich and famous now. I have something big planned, Dylan. And whatever you do, stay out of my way. Welcome back, everyone, to my show. I'm Diane, and I know you love me. Now, I have the newest and biggest celebrity here on the show with me. Everyone, welcome the magnificent Danny. Thank you, Diane. You are so lucky to have me on your show. Yes, I am. Now, everyone is talking about the viral video of your seance and how you are the best psychic the world has ever seen. <laughs> yeah, it's true. It's just a gift I've always had. Would you mind giving us a psychic reading right now? Oh, uh, I don't know. Come on, Danny. This is going to make you even more famous than you already are. <laughs> you know what? For you, Diane, sure. <laughs> oh my gosh, what's happening? You're going to buy a new Lambo and it's going to be pink. Well, uh, return it. What? Return it? Why? It's a pink Lambo. <laughs> it's adorable. If you drive it, it's going to explode. Uh, okay, James, cancel my Lambo order <laughs> immediately. Incredible work, Danny. Applaud for him. And thank you for showing everyone how magnificent you really are. Bye-bye. <laughs> Dylan! You're gonna be late for school! Let's go! Sorry, Dad. I'm ready. Oh, hold on. I need to find my car keys. Ugh. Danny, do you know where my car keys are? Um, uh, yeah. Uh, I had a vision. They were in the kitchen. Oh, that's my famous psychic son. Dude, what are you doing? You're not ready for school. We're gonna be late. Yeah, I'm not going to school anymore. What are you talking about? You have to go to school. Actually, he cannot go to school anymore. I'm taking Danny out of school to focus on his psychic abilities. This is so stupid. Danny doesn't have a gift. He's faking this whole thing. Dad, Dylan is killing my energy. I feel like I can't have any visions when he's around. Dylan, stop killing his energy and stop being a jerk. You can walk to school today. What? No, it's raining out. Ha! <laughs> Bet you didn't see that coming, but I did. Shut up, you liar. That's it. Now get to walking or you're going to be late. Ugh, unbelievable. Dude, you took him out of school? That's ridiculous. I know. I saw him on the Diane show. That psychic reading he gave her was totally bogus. Anyone could see that. Well, apparently not. I can't let him do this anymore. So, what are you going to do now? I need to find a way to expose him and stop him for good. But now he knows you're on to him. He'll be watching you to make sure you don't trip him up. That's why he didn't let you go to that stupid seance. I know. But that is why I think I need your help. Look, dude, I didn't want to get involved with this. But I think it might be the only way. I'll help you out this time. Thanks, man. You're the best friend ever. <laughs> I know. Now, let's put a stop to your spoiled brother once and for all. Dude, I can't believe I now have my own psychic store. This is gonna be sick. 
You mean we have a psychic store? Yeah, 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 of course. Now we can give people psychic readings here. And since I'm famous, we can charge more. Whoa, sweet. How much you thinking? I was thinking like a thousand bucks a reading, maybe 5,000, you know. I'll have so much money, I won't even know what to do with it. Oh, okay, get lost. I think we have our first customer. Welcome to Magnificent. Ugh, oh, it's you. What do you want, Logan? I saw you on the tie-in show, man. I want to read it. You're Dylan's best friend. <laughs> You're just here to mess with me. Uh, no, dude, I believe you, trust me. Can you at least help me out with something? Ah, uh, yeah, fine, come on over here. Okay, the spirits are talking to me. Uh, yeah, what do they say? Uh, dude, Logan's like super smart. Just tell him he's gonna win the science fair, just say that. Okay, I see you winning the science fair. Uh, that was last week, dude. I mean, I did win, but... Okay, uh, let me try again. Oh, gosh. Uh, I don't know. I can't find anything on this guy. Uh, just make something up. Uh, okay, uh, uh looks like you're gonna get a car for Christmas. Dude, I don't celebrate Christmas. I'm Jewish. What is this? Uh, you know what? You're stupid. Your your vibes are all wrong. Reading over, give me 5,000 bucks. Yeah, right. I'm not paying you anything. You suck, dude. Did you get it, man? Yeah. I got the whole thing. Now, I finally have the evidence we need. Dad, I showed you the video, and you still don't believe it? I believe you and your friend played a mean prank on your little brother. No, Dad. Danny's just faking this whole thing. That's enough. Now, your brother said he had a surprise for us, and he wanted us to meet him here. I want you on your best behavior. Okay, Danny, we're here. What's the big surprise? This is the big surprise. This is my brand new mansion. Oh my gosh, Danny. Wow, good job. <laughs> I know, I know. Come inside and check it out. Wow, son. I'm very proud of you. So, when do we all get to move in? We? Oh, no, Dad. This is my house. I need to live here on my own. You know, to boost my psychic energy and, uh, you know. Of course! You only care about yourself and your fake psychic scheme. Well, since this is my house, that means it's my rules. Dylan, I want you out, and you're never welcome back here ever again. Fine by me. I can't stand being around liars. I can't wait until your selfishness catches up with you, Danny. Yeah, whatever. Why is he so mean to me, Dad? I, I hate him. Dylan thinks you're pretending to be psychic. He even showed me a video to prove it. A video? What video? Oh, he filmed that reading with his stupid friend, man! Now he says he has proof that I'm a fake! Well, we got an even bigger problem, Danny. You haven't paid me in three months, dude! Oh, uh, I, I haven't? I thought I Venmoed you yesterday. No, you did it, And you promised me I'd get half of the money we make. And I got nothing for three months! You're gonna pay me right now. If you don't give me that money, I'm gonna expose you myself. You wouldn't dare. Yes, I would. No one double crosses Todd. Not even you. I will give you one last chance. Give me my money. No, if you want money, go get it on your own. So this is how it's gonna be, huh? Fine. You're gonna regret this, loser. Dad, dad. Dad's at work. What do you want? Oh, Dylan, thank goodness. I need your help. Todd quit last night. Wow, I'm surprised he lasted this long. Why'd he quit? Ah, he was begging me for money like a poor person, so I told him to kick rocks. He says he's going to expose me. I need you to stop him. Stop him? Yeah, no. I tried to get you to stop all of this months ago. I even tried to expose you myself, but you wouldn't listen to me. So now, you need to learn the hard way. No, ah, this sucks. I'm finally rich and famous. I won't give that up just to learn a stupid lesson. I know. And that's why I won't help you. Ugh, you are the worst brother ever! Hey, Logan, dude, you're not gonna believe what happened this morning. Uh, dude, look at this. Welcome back, everyone. I know you all know about that magnificent Danny, the teenage psychic. What you don't know is the truth. Dun, dun, dun. I have Danny's best friend here with me on the show, Todd. X, 
best friend, Diane. <laughs> Spicy. You said you had some gossip for me, and you know I love gossip. What is the truth that you have about the great and magnificent Danny? Yeah, Danny's not magnificent. He's a fake. <gasps> a fake? Danny's no psychic. He made me help him cheat the whole time. Oh, wow. So, why are you coming clean now? Because he wouldn't give me the money he owed me. You mean the money you two scammed people out of? Yeah, exactly, Diane. Danny's a scammer, and he's a total fake, and everyone needs to know it. I'm innocent, though. He made me do everything. Oh, dude, this is huge. Yeah, I guess I don't need to expose Danny myself anymore. I can't believe this. My son is a scammer. I just want to get in there and give your brother a piece of my mind. No, this sucks. Ugh, I hate Todd. What a loser. Daniel Steven Anderson. Oh, Dad, I'm so happy you're here. I need some cash. My bank accounts are frozen. Oh, it's so stupid. You know what's stupid? Lying and scamming millions of people out of millions of dollars. How could you? What? It's not a big deal. It's a huge deal! How can you lie to me like that? I am your father! I took you out of school! Uh, what is that? It sounds like the police. Open up, you scammer! Oh no, I can't go to jail! Jail's for idiots! Danny, stop! All right, where's the criminal? He's under arrest! He just ran out back. Seriously? Ugh, I hate running! Get back here, you loser! That's right, everyone. The fake psychic, magnificent Danny, he is on the run. They urge if anyone who sees Danny to call the police immediately. I hate you, Danny. You are the worst person in the world. How could I have been so stupid? I should have listened to you from the beginning. Can you um forgive me? Of course, Dad. I love you. Strangely enough, I still love Danny, too. All I can think about right now is your brother, on the run from the police. He must be so scared, I know I would be! Well, maybe this will scare him into doing the right thing. I hope so. But there's something I really want you to do. I want you to go out there and find your brother, and bring him home. I can try, but you know Danny. He's as stubborn as a horse. He might not even want to come home. Well, make him! We can't have your brother being a fugitive. He needs his family right now. Okay, I'll see what I can do. Ugh, Todd better help me after everything he's done. He owes me. Oh, you gotta be kidding me. What do you want? I need your help, dude. The police are looking for me. Yeah, sure thing, man. I'll hide you if you pay me all the money you owe me. Ugh, I can't pay you, Todd. They froze my bank accounts. Well then, I guess I won't be helping you after all. Oh, come on, dude. You're my best friend. You're my only friend. I am not your friend. I just wanted the money. And since you refuse to give me that money, you're useless to me. What are you doing? 911, what's your emergency? That scam artist Danny's at my house right now. Ugh, you're the worst, Todd. No, you're the worst. I've been looking for Danny everywhere, but I still can't find him. Wherever he's hiding, it must be pretty well hidden. <laughs> Oh, come on. Yeah, this is a spaceship. Hey, Danny, wake up. Uh, no, I hate aliens. Oh, it's just you. Is this really where you're hiding in the school library? Yeah, man. No one ever comes in here. It's perfect. Danny, you need to put a stop to all of this. You need to give all this up and give back the money you stole from people. And maybe if you do, the cops will go easy on you. You know what? I have a better idea. I want you to get my secret stash of cash and give it to me. What? Secret stash? Yeah, I hid it under my bed for safekeeping. Just bring it to me, okay? I need that money. Hey, scammer! You stole my money, you loser, and I want it back! Uh, no, get lost! Oh yeah? How about I give you a knuckle sandwich? Ah, stay away from me! Get back here, you twerp! Yep, here it is, just like he said it would be. This must be like a million dollars or something. Oh my gosh. Dylan, what are you doing in here? Looking for this. Is that Danny's money? Yep, I saw him at school today and he said he wanted this. Hold on, hold on. You saw your brother and you didn't bring him back? I tried to, but he refused. <laughs> of course he did. I'm so disappointed in him. Yeah, I am too. Thought maybe all of this would really set him straight, but he loves the attention. Attention? Ugh, 
just don't know why he won't own up to what he did. Because he thinks what he did was not wrong. Well, you're not going to give him that money. No, I'm not. I'm going to go turn it over to the police. Good. I'm glad I raised one son to do the right thing. Let's just go turn this money over to the police and go looking for him. He couldn't have gone very far. Well, he's not at the mall or at the park, so where the heck could he be? Back off, you creep! This is mine! No way! This is my burger, fool! Ah! Woohoo! I'm rich! Ugh, why didn't you stop him? What the heck was that? What? I was hungry, and I can't buy food without money. I had to steal it. You know, you didn't have to do that, right? You could just come home with me right now. Dad and I can help you. You don't want to help me. You just want to turn me in for the reward money. Will you just listen to yourself? We're your family. I'm your brother. Dad and I want to help you. Stop acting like a spoiled brat and wake up. Do you want to live the rest of your life as a fugitive? No, it sucks. Then let's go home. Uh, fine, whatever. Oh, man, did you make this? It kind of sucks, <laughs> but it's better than the food from a dumpster, I guess. Wow, thanks, dude. Where is he? Hey, Dad. Don't you hey, Dad me! What the heck is wrong with you? What is your problem? I thought you wanted me home. What I want is for you to stop acting like an idiot and turn yourself into the police. But I don't want to. What if I have to go to jail? You need to face the consequences of your actions, young man. Consequences are lame. I should be able to do whatever I want. That is not how the world works. Clearly, you haven't learned anything from this. I hope this will teach you a lesson. Yeah. <laughs> no running away this time, Bojo. Oh, no. Dad, Dylan, please help me. Yeah. <laughs> you know, shut up and get walking. I hope we did the right thing. We did, Dad. Now it's up to Danny to do the right thing. All right, here you go. Your brand new home, you criminal. Ugh, you know what? You suck. Also, you smell horrible. Shut up. It's just my feet. I have a condition. You know what? Whatever. I'm still over this. You're going to get stuck in here forever. Who's the loser now, huh? Wait, hold on. What? I've got a lean cuisine in the mic. Make it quick. Listen, you know I'm super rich, right? I have millions of dollars, and I was able to take this before you arrested me. <gasps> oh my gosh, I love money. <laughs> I know, I do too. If you let me out of here, all this can be yours, and I can give you even more money. Give it to me right now! Woohoo! I love money so much! <laughs> Sucker! What? What is this? What's happening? Um, I tricked you, idiot! Later! Wait, stop right there, little ma'ams! Think I'm buried. Did that ma'am trick you with monums? Yeah, he was so mean! You let the criminal escape, y'all! So what? I do it all the time! Let me out! No way, Finkenberry! You messed up big this time! And you gotta stay right here, y'all! <gasps> what? No! Oh no! Someone's breaking into our house! Oh, come on! Where is it? Where is it? I put it somewhere here! Hold on, Danny? What are you doing? I'm looking for my stash of cash, loser! Where is it? I need my money now! Oh yeah, I found it, and I gave it back to the police. You did what? You betrayed me! How could you do this? How could I? How could you do all of this? How could you scam people, lie to me and dad, and run away from the police? Because I'm the magnificent Danny! I'm awesome, and I always get what I want! Now get the heck out of my way! No, Danny, stop! You're not gonna catch me, loser! <laughs> you thought you could escape Ossifer Rufus? Okay, you wild, y'all. You going to Yale again. Yes. Come on, let me out of here. This place sucks and I hate it. Oh, Dylan, thank goodness. Just unlock that door and I'll sneak out the back. No, I hope this teaches you a lesson, dude. Good luck. Wait, no, stop. Come back. Dylan! 